Hey Zahira, can you hear me now? I should be back up. I do apologize for that. <laughs> I should be back up and ready to go. Let me know if you are still there and you can still hear me. Otherwise, we will just keep on going. Looks like I am back up on my end. So I'm going to go ahead and start where we left off. So last we left off, <laughs> last we left off, uh, Clive is setting off to confront Barnabas Tharn, awaiting atop the crown of reverie after he goaded us into trying to go, uh, after he goaded us into saying we are not presentable yet, but we are off to confront him right now. So anyways, travelers, let's go ahead and let's get right into it. I hope you all are having a good morning. Please tell me about your weekend and I hope we, uh, let's, let's adventure together. All right, just doing one final check, making sure everything looks good so we don't do that again. Yeah, everything looks good on my end. Looks like we are continuing, so let's get right to it. I can feel it. We are super close, super close to the end game, and I am so excited. <laughs> so this Monday stream is making up for the fact that I was not able to stream on Friday doing Final Fantasy Fridays, but we are here now. Right, Torgo, lead the way. Does anyone else like spin the floors as you go up on stuff? Just me? <laughs> Oh my gosh, bro. I'm a pickle, 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 pickle. How was your vacation? Please tell me. The man's of Final Fantasy. Please tell me your vacation was the best and you had the most amazing relaxing time. I am so happy for you. Well deserved. Well deserved. So thank you so much for tuning in. How are you doing? <laughs> Yeah, we're getting close to the end of Final Fantasy, so... You're filled with splendor? I'm so glad. I'm so glad. It's what we like to hear. Yeah, that was, a uh, That was completely all my bad, Zahiro. 
I realized I had the incorrect scene on during the stream and I tried to change it during the stream and my computer was like, <laughs> get wrecked. <clears throat> yeah, I did not like that. So make sure you have your correct scene going. I don't know if you use multiple scenes. And I see the benefit of some people who do that. Like they just have one scene for every game. But I try to do a different scene for each game, depending on where the gameplay is, the icons, and sometimes it uh, does not work to my advantage. say he has to almost be there. Blueberry, blueberry. Blueberry. Thanks for tuning in, Mincy. How are you doing this morning? And Pickle, I am doing quite well, thank you. I actually just had a weekend getaway myself in the mountains. It was the best. It was the most beautiful. We are starting to have snow on the mountains, and it is absolutely gorgeous. The trees are starting to turn. Everything looks beautiful for fall. Spooky season is in full swing. It was amazing. Oh my gosh. Um, so we left Friday. It's about a three hour drive. We took a very scenic route to get up. Otherwise it would have taken us two hours, but we decided we wanted to take a more scenic route to get up. And we went up to this little, just like little mountain town, nothing crazy. There's this very specific kind of crunchy granola shop, outdoor apparel shop that my wife wanted to go to that you have to like make an appointment for him like months in advance and then even then you only get to buy like two items uh so we kind of just based a trip around that with her cousin too who um her cousin is pregnant uh so it was a kind of good way to celebrate be with uh her cousin and just to go shopping and uh enjoy the mountain town and we went hiking so like two days so it was it was just great and the airbnb was so cute we played board games just had a good old time yeah, no, me too. And yeah, spooky season is my favorite. Fall is amazing. So, and yeah, snow just started to like cross the, uh, you know, the peaks of the mountain. So it looked beautiful. Yeah, fall is the best. I love fall. Although I do acknowledge people can be fall people without being spooky fall people. But I feel like all spooky people are fall people. I could be wrong. <laughs> Yeah, well, happy early birthday. I feel like you haven't had it yet, then, if that's the case. I love Halloween. So my wife and I were actually going to go as Flynn Rider and Rapunzel this year. That'll be our costumes. My birthday is okay. That birthday falls very close to Christmas, so it's just like, eh. Eh, I get the toys on my birthday and I get the batteries on Christmas to play with them. Very nice. for your anniversary oh my gosh and three days before halloween that is that is great that is a lot to celebrate I understand why that would be your favorite how many years if you don't mind me asking not for the birthday for the anniversary well done, 
I was not gonna be that rude. <laughs> Hey, Tiny Princess, thank you so much for coming in from KDT. Okay, yeah. Well, in all fairness, I am that T. 3 0. A lot of amazing people. So. Gosh. <laughs> thank you so much for the follow, Tiny Princess. I feel like my 20s were very weird. I feel like I am still fully learning how to be an adult, even though I'm doing adult things. So. I don't know. Do you ever fully feel grown up? I hope I never fully feel grown up. I always hope I feel a little bit like a kid at times. Otherwise, oh boy, that'd be sad. <laughs> Flame Wyvern, thank you so much from KDT. Thank you so much for coming in, guys. I appreciate it. We're about to, hopefully, hopefully, I just got a high potion. I imagine. No, you're not supposed to. And my height, my height definitely suggests that I'm never fully grown up. I... <laughs> oh man, I'm a uh, yeah. <laughs> well, for for those of you coming in, I think we are about to actually head right to a boss fight, so it'll be fun. It'll be a good time. I think we're gonna confront Barnabas Thom, who is Odin. We could ever get to the top of this massive structure. Okay. I think we're almost there. Good morning. How are you doing today? I'm such a childish person that I'm 22. Yeah, I still make inappropriate jokes here and there. Still have all my nerdy stuff. It's definitely like that meme or whatever. That's like you buy a toy and it's like, oh my gosh, your kid's going to love that. Uh, absolutely. My kid's going to love that. <laughs> Yep, I am a variety streamer and I focus on RPGs primarily. Uh, I do play shooters, but not good enough to stream them. Uh, so yes, I do focus on... I'm going to pause this so I can actually talk to you real quick. Uh, so yes, I'm a newly traveler. I like leading travelers on new adventures with an emphasis on RPGs and solo player games. So currently what I'm doing is I'm playing Final Fantasy because I'm making up for Friday, which is Final Fantasy Fridays, I wasn't able to stream. I needed massively to catch up on sleep. Otherwise, I am currently streaming Starfield, generally on Mondays, Wednesdays, might mix that up. But then Tuesdays, Thursdays, I'm doing a co-op stream with one of my good friends, RP James 3, and we are doing Baldur's Gate 3. So, uh, all at the same time, Monday through Friday, starting at 9 a.m. Eastern time, if you are into that thing. So I'm always looking for uh, more RPG streamers as well. But yeah, tell me what you're into. Oh, yeah, it's so easy just to follow and keep up and just enjoy the story. And with the amount of cutscenes Final Fantasy has, even better. Oh, I'm just getting wrecked. Hang on. Guess I'll use an ultimate. On Xbox? Nice. What do you play? Flame Wyvern. What is your go to? Oh, 
don't know why I did that. That was a dumb ultimate to use at that time. I just panicked. Appreciate everyone who can do the racing. Hey, no worries. Go lurk, bro. I don't know why I'm calling you, bro. I need to call you Pickle. Pickle, have an amazing lurk. I love you. I'm going to catch you very soon on Tarkov. So, I hope you have a good rest of your day, and I'm glad your vacation was amazing. And Tiny Princess, I gotta say, I absolutely admire people who can do the racing games like that. Like, with the actual steering wheel and the whole setup and all that, and that is phenomenal. So I gotta ask, is it, are you into Gran Turismo? Are you excited for the movie? Have you seen, well, I don't know, has the movie come out yet? Or is Gran Turismo kind of like a, I don't know where it falls into the racing game world. <laughs> like, do people take it seriously? Are there better games? I just, I don't know. Was it good? Was it a good movie? It looked decent. From what I could tell, I don't know anything about it. see what else we have equipped here just so we can see nope, all trash trash okay cool cool Okay, well, thanks for not spoiling it. I'll be sure to check it out. I like the premise of it, and I like the idea that we can be so far into technology that we can make racing simulation almost as real, or getting close to real as the actual thing. That to me is so intriguing. And the whole concept of VR, I'm like, I'm all ready for it. I want it to be a thing. Are we finally to the boss fight? No, we're to the pre-boss fight to the pre-boss fight. Well, that's new. No I expected a full like all the rest. Yeah. 
You don't play Gran Turismo. Unfortunately, as I don't have a play... Oh, I didn't realize it was PlayStation 5 only. Or PlayStation only. Okay, Xbox Series X. Oh, that is a bummer. That is exclusive to PlayStation. I'm really trying to understand, or... I mean, I guess I get it. Some of the console X, you know, being exclusive to a console, but I don't understand why you wouldn't sell your game to a wider audience because I feel like you don't make your money off of consoles. You make your money off of subscriptions and you make your money off of games, but I could be wrong. And microtransactions, a shit ton of microtransactions. And that's how you make your money. I don't see how, for instance, like Gran Turismo being on PlayStation 5 or even for that matter, Starfield just being on Xbox. I don't know. I don't get it. I think if you have a console, you should be able to play it if the specs are right. But that is me. What was that thing? Hopefully there aren't any more. Might be more. Let's go ahead. Where do we need to go? Lead the way, Torgal. Yep, that way. Let's go ahead and use this. You mean with the anime? I, <laughs> I don't. I only have so much time that I think I'm okay with what I have, but it would take me forever, forever to catch up on everything that I actually want to catch up on. So unfortunately, I made the decision. There are just some things I'm never gonna do in the anime world, and I'm okay with that. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. <laughs> Man, this move should get rid of both of them. Hey, y'all. God, how big is this place? Jesus. We may get to the boss by the end of this stream, depending. Yeah. No, that is unfortunate. Monster Hunter. I don't... <clears throat> not a lot of good games at the moment, but I play Monster Hunter World and Monster Hunter Rise, Rocket League, Call of Duty Zombies. Nice. Killing Floor 2, Overwatch 2. You know, that's still a lot. That is still a lot. I always admire people that can do Rocket League. It just... It, oh, man. It does not look like my thing. No. But... Yeah, for me right now, I have to limit myself to how many games I'm playing. So I'm doing Sea of Stars off stream, Baldur's Gate 3, Starfield, and Final Fantasy 16. Probably once I beat this, I'll transition to Final Fantasy 7 Remake. Because I've never played it. And Rebirth's coming out, so that'll be cool. I know, Monster Hunter is cool. I like that a lot. What do you play it on, though? Xbox. Because I see that they have some for the Switch, and I'm like, ooh, is it actually worth it on the Switch? Like, are the graphics worth it? Are the controls good? Or should I just play it on console? And I feel like I'm leaning towards you should play it on console. Nope, not a boss fight. Another pre-boss fight. Gotta love Final Fantasy. Like a machine. No worries. Thank you so much, Tiny Princess. Go get some food. I'll be here. I appreciate you.
cheese it. We'll cheese it with some bigger moves. I'm fine with that. Come on, Clive, you got this. It's just a ball. Just a ball. Hey, Retro Ghost, how's it going? How are you doing? Thank you so much for coming in. I hope you're having a good Monday. Are you still rocking the Final Fantasy IX? I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. A little tired. I hope work is less crazy. It's been insanely crazy leading up to a trial. So I feel like I've been MIA. And I hate that feeling. But I'm doing good. I think this week will be a lot more chill. So... I gotta pause it because you said Mass Effect. You finished FF9 and you're doing Mass Effect. I'm definitely gonna catch you during some of my free time. Mass Effect is one of my all time, all time favorite game series of all time. I sunk so many hours into that. I remember I bought that one summer, the Mass Effect trilogy, and I just played it the entire summer. I think I did like six different playthroughs on like each game when I was younger. I absolutely adore it. I love it. I have an N7 helmet that's hanging up. Um, but yeah, absolutely love, love, love Mass Effect. And nice, you're looking for people to play Roblox with. Unfortunately, I am not a Roblox guy. <laughs> I, I tried it just to see what it was about. And unfortunately, it's not for me. Um, but I know there's plenty of people that could do it. I'm sure there's discords for it as well for people looking to group up and do stuff. Um, but that's awesome, Retro. I'm going to catch you. I'm going to catch you doing <laughs> Mass Effect. That, oh, so many good memories. So many good memories. It's like a core memory. <laughs> you know what, Retro? I'm like, are we ever going to get to Barnabas in this? I don't know if you played FF16, but I feel like I've had so many pre-bosses right now. No worries. Then I won't say anything more to you. I don't want to spoil anything.
on, almost staggered. There we go. Such a beefy guy. You think in any universe that would kill someone, but there we go. Oh man. Okay. So we've had the node, that guy. Another, so that's three pre-bosses. Let's just get to the actual boss fight. That's all I want. I like the fact that with Roblox, you can both play and create. And I like the idea that there's so many different mini games that you can almost make anything you want. To me, that is really cool. I would love to learn how to code eventually. That would be awesome. <laughs> but I'm glad you're enjoying it. All right, travelers, are we there? We're going to have more traveling to do. There. My foot, we're almost there. Yeah, what's that about? Tell me about it. What is doors? I feel like if we're almost there, that was a lot of work, and I don't know when. <laughs> The autosave happened, so we're going to go ahead and overwrite that. Just in case. He's here. I can feel him. The blade must ever feed if her edge is to remain keen. Butcher. What care you for these worthless creatures? They are nothing. Weak from the moment of their conception, ever longing for power not theirs to command, they turn unfailingly upon themselves. Like sheep. They roam in filthy flocks, eager to trample those few gifted a fleece of gold. Or that they might feel contentment with their pitiful existence. Prejudice and persecution, severance and strife, every earthly wrong springs from the malice in men's hearts. Malice you tell him, the pain and suffering that is free will. Its corruption is gnawed at your being from the very moment of your birth. You're wrong. It is no corruption. It is who I am. Every choice I make, right or wrong, gives me reason to carry on. And carry on I shall. Not as a puppet, but as a man. He's a real boy. Real Which are you? <laughs> there was a time I too thought those the only choices. What? Long ago, God granted man the gift of magic. And with that gift did he build great civilizations. Yet over time, 
man lost sight of the gift's true meaning, stepping from the path of shared prosperity to one of avarice. He abandoned his creator for sword and flame, and through his folly, beckoned the blight. Yet, there were those few who refused to turn their eyes from the heavens, and they prayed to God that he might lead them back to righteousness. And the Lord, he did answer. Before the worthy shall the gates of paradise open, and so did I spread my arms to the ether, and cast my soul upon its gentle waters. You are all good, Sierra. Don't even worry about it. Try running it as administrator if you're having issues. your kind are to find salvation, they must be made to serve. You see, paradise lies but a single step away. Could we only take it? Oh no! Could we only leave our trans- Oh no! You had to set it up because your husband wiped your computer and it was constantly crashing. Oh my gosh. I am so sorry to hear that. You got this, I believe. That, oh man, I would hate to have to reset everything with everything I put into it. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry to hear that. And then Flame Wyvern, you have to go through a hundred doors surviving entities. It's a crazy little puzzle here and there. Once while you get to an object to help you. It's fun if you get the achievement, you unlock modifiers. It even has a special door with the different entities and lot difficult. Oh, that sounds fun. Kind of sounds like you don't know what you're going to get. That's, that's a pretty cool game. And ah, oh, I'm so sorry. Well, hopefully you'll reset it. Fix it, and we'll be good to go from there. That way you can get right back to it. Russians behind. For none save the pure of heart and mind may set foot in the new world. I will save us. But it all begins and ends with you. You are the key, Mythos. And with this humble offering, shall I prove my faith once more. So you forsook your kingdom. You forsook yourself to serve. Tell me. Forsook? How is that living? Is that is that like a... I feel like I would use in forsake. You forsaked yourself. Forsook? What you seek to provide what a is weird not word. salvation. It's anything but. Life is about always having a choice. Take that away. And we might as well be dead. Welcome to Final Fantasy. Attractive people carrying big swords. Oh, just in time, tiny princess. We're almost there. Very well. Come then. Show us the strength of your will. It's not the strength of my will that should worry you. But the weakness of yours. Ooh, got him. <laughs> okay, Power Ranger, let's go. If you think your will the stronger, prove it. By this day's end, you shall know the truth. He's a fast little one, that's for sure. Thank you. 
I am tickling him. Oh, I walked right into that. This is my bad. I know this is only going to be like his first form, and it's just going to be so much harder after this. I know, he is doing massive damage. I am playing on hard. I will channel my inner Sisu. Absolutely. They'll probably do cutscenes where I can do more damage to him. And it's not like I'm under leveled. I'm level 43, and the max you can get is 50 on the first playthrough. Sisu so bad. I feel like it was only in theaters for a hot second and then it went away. I always think like Efri is so huge and he's like one of the smaller primates. Torgo's like, you good, man? You good? Okay. You will not defeat me otherwise. We'll see. Perhaps you still are my master.
There is so much happening. Hey, Amir, welcome, man. Hey, Arnold Creek, let me catch up on the chat. <laughs> da, 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 da. The Dash, thank you so much for the lurk. I greatly appreciate it. Amir, welcome in. Gotta love your pot of noodles. Absolutely, tiny princess. And have I ever played Immortals Phoenix Rising? I have not, but I have heard amazing things about it. And I think it would be right up my alley. Defeated. You admitted defeat the moment you turned your back on us. When you turned your back on the truth, Barnabas. We are not as weak as your God believes. Tor goal. Oh. Okay, he's good. We're good. He's good. Oh. I was gonna save the dog. I think I would be interested. I like the concept of it. to prime again, my man. Is it here? That is great to hear. I'm glad. I'm glad it looks like it's up and working now. Come on, Clive. You got this. Pull yourself together. sword.
swoop. Could it be you have made a weapon of your weakness? <laughs> My apologies. You are not the fool I took you Oh, for. Mortal's Phoenix Rising 2 is cancelled. Hopefully they'll make it. Hopefully. But it looks like it is a good game in and of itself. And Hancho, oh, I'm doing good. I am doing great. I'm feeling a lot better. Horrible time to lose your priming, dude. I'm feeling a lot better. You are tired, Mythos. Your stubborn defiance has stirred my long becalmed heart, filling it with a joy that I have not known for generations. Thank you. I appreciate it. Had a good, relaxing weekend mountain getaway with the wife. This was exactly what I needed. <laughs> this guy is crazy. Really needed that one to hit. Jesus! Uh, it is still my first playthrough, yeah. Glad I can't see shit right now. Don't worry, I do have more items. I was just holding off on using them.
can't even hit him from there. I can't even hit him, what? So lame. Became a fidget spinner. I totally forgot to bring him down on that one with the half parry, but oh well, we're good. I hate that attack so much. <laughs> Just as incredible as the battle I have with my cat. Oh my god. I'll look at chat in a second, guys. <laughs> Almost there. Let's finish him off with the Giga Flare. That should take us home. Oh. Didn't even get his head off. Bruh. And we both Bruh. The truth. What's up, Fat? How are you doing? Welcome in. You stand victorious. My will the prevailed. You did. I'm doing this just for you. Your will? No. Just for you, man. I felt so bad about Friday. It was his. Clive Rossfield. Red versus blue. You came right at the end. You came right at the end. Oh, man. Well, we did it, chat. We did it. And I leveled up. I would hope so after that fight. That was ridiculous. Ooh, dark shard. Probably upgrade my weapon. That was such a cool fight, though. Oh, my gosh. That was really cool. Double tap. Got a double tap. Just... It's okay. Don't even worry about it, my man. You are all good. <laughs> Unlike Barnabas. Perhaps there is strength in will. Would that I had not relinquished my own. <laughs> <laughs> Barn of butt. Yeah. You relinquish.
accomplished nothing. What was it, if not will, that made you strive for a new world? Strive to win your master's approval? I... I'm not saying you're wrong, but you're not right. <laughs> you were shown a fantasy, and you chose fantasy. to believe it. Fantasy. But you were wrong. There is no world but the one we live in. And that world, that world is worth saving, even if it means killing a god. A man. I want a man to strive to be Clive. I still would have double tapped him, but that's why. Bold <laughs> words from one who has served the Lord so well. Ooh, does Ultima want Pointless. the Mother Crystals destroyed? That would be interesting. But I almost forgot. <laughs> I promised that I would make you presentable, did I not? Oh, he's gonna give me his powers. We shall fulfill our destinies. Yeah. You think Clive of all people would know that? Just as the Lord's mother crystals have really? Their Clive, kick him in the face. Come, kick him in the face. Torgal, I feel like you could bite him. Kick him in the face. Pull away. Or chop off his hand. Nope, got your foot. Got your foot. <laughs> You've done that sooner. Okay, can we double tap him now? Or at this point, like triple tap him? I think he's done if he transferred his powers. I'm coming home. Looks like he's turning to stone. Mother. Okay, we're good. He dead. Five, you're positively yet. glowing. No. Come then, O oh wayward child. We shall await you upon the back of the first worm. There, all shall end and begin again. Hmm. Correct me if I'm wrong. But I feel like by giving him all the powers to take all the powers, he could maybe use said powers against you to defeat you. That is such anime logic. But what do I? You tell him, Clive. Sometimes you just gotta yell. Now he's like, I'm tired.
I really like the powers I currently have, but I'm wondering if we do observe Odin's. Are any of Odin's worth actually having? Here's the thing, though. Even with gods, there's always a creature, higher being, that's even bigger, even badder, even more powerful. Run, uncle! My man. My, my man. You just ran. Hey, just got spelled backwards, my man. That's why it's a man's best friend. What indeed? <laughs> the enemy numbers 200,000 or more counting yours. There are simply not enough soldiers counting in the capital to repel an army of that size. Then, one of the central keep, held by a contingent of soldiers and bearers from the surrounding forest. They are the sole reason it still stands. And all it took was an army on their doorstep to bring them together. The prospect of death does put things into perspective. <laughs> perspective. Perhaps it's what we've lacked all along. I love that you know that fat. That's awesome. You're just like counting it. Have you met Clive? Heck yeah. Mayhap they are the wrong men. Well, I'll be damned. Yeah, my boy. Dion. Oh, no, but I shall rally as many of my dragoons as I'm able. You, apprise the Lord Strategist of the state of the city's defenses. Yes, Your Radiance. And you would fight alongside us. I owe the Phoenix a debt. <laughs> Does this vouch for my nephews? Aye, but I still have my doubts about you. Which we can discuss later. Indeed. You said you had men garrisoned in the keep. Captain, do you know how many yet remain? Allow me to confirm. Commander? Whatever their number, Randalar will be needing them all. Gather the bodies and build a pyre in the courtyard. Quickly. Terence. My lord. You will find a girl there. A girl? We are in the middle of a war. I owe her my life, and I always pay my debts. You are to see that she is provided for. Dion, I cannot leave. But oh, the girl that saved him, yeah. If I'm ever to be worthy of the forgiveness of our people, then I must earn it. And I must the music is so beautiful. Hand, it's so beautiful. My hand alone. The oath that I 
do not ask this like me. And now. And know that I will do it. Oh. I hope they can be together in the end. I hope nothing bad happens to them. They deserve the happy ending. Some time later. East LA. East left. Clive, thank fuck. You all right? I am. But I'm a damn sight better for seeing you, Joshua. And Barnabas. The king is dead. Have you heard about our hideaway? <laughs> they are. What was that? So is their killer. He can't hurt anyone anymore. You see. Thank you so much for the lurk, Tiny Princess. I appreciate it. Thank you for being here. I'm sorry, Clive. You know I want nothing more than to go with you. I do. But I'm glad you're heading back to the Enterprise nonetheless. And not just for Edda's sake. Our people need to know what happened here. You can count on me. As can she, I hope. Thank you, me lords. That would be really cool. That is if you they released a DLC where you played you through the story as Joshua. I think that'd be really cool. Wiser than leaving a woman with child alone in the Deadlands. They'll be safer at the hideaway. For now, at least. That'd be really cool. Get his story. This land is overrun with Akashic. The king himself was long turned. We'll be here by choice. All to serve Ultima in his damnable quest to forge the perfect vessel. Me. Perfect vessel. The chaos Barnabas wreaked upon nation after nation. How many were killed for this? Uh, he didn't consider it killing. Or a 
Mercy of sorts. A way to end their suffering. He truly wanted to save mankind, and ultimately use that. As he uses us. Joshua. Are you gonna tell him? Are you gonna tell him? You have to combine. We are dominance. That is our fate. But that doesn't mean we have to accept it, which is why we fight. For the right to deny it. Is that not so? It is. For our sins. Barnabas said something else. That the Mother Crystals were Ultimas. Ultimas? Are you certain? Hey! Listen! Hey, listen! We Nito, welcome in. How are you doing this morning? Leading the land of Ether. I think it's still morning for you. We also know that it's this for a little bit. Hastens the spread of the blight. But what I cannot fathom is. How are you doing this wonderful Monday? Ultima stands to gain from that. What did you find at the stronghold? It's going. The truth about Ultima's prize. I'm doing good. I can't complain. For so long. I hope this week is a lot more chill at work. And you alone. Yet, it is not merely a freed that he desires, but a freed and phoenix both. That which we became in the skies over Twinside. Only when the twin flames are joined shall his vessel be complete. Quite why they he are joined the vessel, is another question. Unless. There is something he cannot achieve without one. Something his immaterial form precludes. Something requiring an unthinkable amount of ether and a body resilient enough to channel it. If I did not know better, brother, I would think that he meant to cast a spell. A spell a thousand years in the making. A spell to end all spells. And he cannot do it without us. Ah, but I could never. the mother crystals. But if we destroy them all, we will stop not only the blight, but Ultima as well. We stick to the plan then. Only this time, we face him together. Well, I sure hope so, Nita. Here. I think if I stream Let's this game waiting. today, Wednesday, and Friday, I might be able to finish it. It depends on how many side quests there are. Leo Ad Brotherhood is the name of the quest. The power of darkness. Clive has claimed a portion of the icon Odin's essence. Attuning with Odin not only changes the elemental aspects of Clive's magic spells, but also allows access to several new iconic abilities, such as Gunnir, frenetic flurry of attacks that damage all enemies within range. Ability details are found in the abilities tab. Yep, yep, yep. Odin's feet, arm of darkness, can be used to. Tr t Ooh. That looks. Pretty darn dope. I'm gonna have to look into upgrading some of that. Oh, Liza P. Did it come out today? Did it drop today on Game Pass? When Barnabas. Yes. That'll be really cool. And now the circle is complete. Rift slip. All right. Ooh, that's pretty cool. That looks, that looks 
That looks pretty cool. I might do that one. We're actually going to replace that. Sorry, as cool as the punches are, we are going to get rid of the punches. So it's called the Alliance. So then we can go over to our yep, attributes here. Or do we have to go over to abilities? I have to go over to abilities. Perfect. And that will be a fun one to try out. Well, his magic died with him. The road to stone here is barred to us no longer. Level 44 and still getting tutorials? Yeah, the game thought I needed some help. Let's see, if we're at Brotherhood, let's see how many main quests there are left. There are... Four left. Four main quests left. And probably a ton of side quests. Mag for stone, sure. See, another side quest. We'll keep going this way for a little bit, though. This is no time to ride. No time to ride. All right. You don't think you're going to finish Starfield? What do you mean? Oh, are you playing it on Game Pass? Is that what you mean? What do you mean you don't think you're gonna finish? What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> like, are you not enjoying it? Or... Because I'm really curious if that's the fact, if you're not enjoying Starfield. You're getting bored of it. Interesting. Interesting. What I think I'm gonna, what I think I'm gonna have to do with Starfield, is do the main quest on stream, and then do the side quest off stream. It's just, it's just too much. It is so much. Bodies up ahead. I'm sorry you're getting bored of it. Which part of it? Is there no peace for a dying man? What happened here? Well, I think if that's the case. I just forget, which is what I've been doing. Well, they say the game really opens up at New Game Plus, and I've heard both sides wait for New Game Plus, blast through the story, blah, blah, blah. But maybe if you go through it and you do New Game Plus and you still aren't attracted to it, or it doesn't change it enough for you to want to play it, then you have your answer. But it, maybe it'll help make it more enjoyable. But either way, at the end of the day, I don't think you should ever force yourself to play a game that, even though a lot of people enjoy, if you don't like it, don't do it. The ether floods made savage priests of my companions. And those faithless orcs, I knew they weren't to be trusted. We were told that they would stay loyal to our cause. Something commanded their loyalty, but it was not us. It's a wonder they stayed faithful for so long. Perhaps Honestly, Nito, that would be a great game to stream, Sea of Stars. It is so much fun. In ruins. I'm debating streaming it or not. I'm debating. What becomes of us loyal pawns now? Sworn to a shattered throne. Fuck Wallard. <clears throat> Fuck the dead king and his god. Fuck the king. Fuck this withered shithole. No Game of Thrones references at all. not affect you. You are a bearer, albeit one who's lost his brand. Pray, hear me, brother. Will you grant this pawn his final wish? Will you lay my dying soul to rest? Of course. What do you need? 
Finally, some luck. Beyond the castle walls, towards stone here, there is a forest. Never turn. My parents are buried upon the bluff, nestled amongst the trees. Theirs was the only love I ever knew. I was torn from them in life. Oh. Perhaps I can return to them in death. So, oh. Take my ring. Uh, see that it rests beside their bones. May you find peace at last. Do Liza P. I'm so excited for Liza P. It's going to be great. Jump five. Come on. I've taught you better than this. Every stream he jumps at a weird time when I mean to interact. Don't tell me. The only way to the capital is through that gate, just as you surmise. There's an army down there, Joshua. Yes, but I don't see any dominance. That is a cute little Nami. That's a dinosaur, right? It's so cute. It has its cup and its snacks and it's just nomming away. Oh my gosh. Orbs. The Great Southern Gate. Did I go over the angry gap? I don't remember this. Or a baby dragon. I like baby dragons. We're going to go back and see if the angry gap was anything. I don't remember doing that. So I apologize, chat. If we already did. just really don't remember doing the angry gap but it has been a hot second since i played so my D, &D character actually has a like a i play as a drake warden so i have like a drake pet or drake familiar so i had him from a baby and now he's a medium-sized dragon in my D, D campaign his name is rowan he's adorable he's also named after a character from throne of glass Ooh, Scyther. Yes, yes. Definitely want a Scyther. Love the OG Pokemon. Absolutely. May we all be Pokemon Masters. Oh, we did cross that. I'm lying. Sorry, chat. That was my bad. We did do that. What? That looks like a very suspicious area right there. We're going to at least go visit that. Ambrosia, I've been here the whole time, man. Faster. No holding back. So I know somewhere around this area, yeah, good luck everyone, you can get um, Sephiroth sword. So I'm wondering where it is and if it could be in this location. Ugh, fine, I'll get off. 
deserve a rest. And shown up by a turtle. We all caught it. Chat, what a momentous catch that was. We are all Pokemon Masters. That's amazing that we all caught it. I'm so happy. No one was in range. Let's try our new ability though. Wherever that turtle went. We all got it that's amazing and the dash thank you so much go share the love there are many 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 amazing people i promise i'm gonna give a shout out soon thank you all for joining me that even with the giga flare you can only damage the turtle if you hit the face that is ridiculous That should work this time. You're finished. That was the chunkiest, chunkiest turtle I've ever seen. Yes, this was it. Okay. The hand of Re. Ooh, trial by eyes. Nope. <laughs> I will do those off stream. Those are just so. So. Oh, I hate that it's lower in stats, but I can change the appearance. That is, that is it. That is it. So we can travel back now. Or we can actually, what we can do is we could go to the hideout and equip it. But let's, uh, how much time do I have? Got a little bit of time. Let's see if we can at least get through the next cutscene. While I'm here real quick, there are a lot of amazing people. The level design, Ultima Cluster. 
I don't know. That's a good question. I think they are really leaning into the fact that the blight sucked all the ether, the magic energy away. And that's why it looks a little dull. To showcase that the town has been devastated and drained of all its magical properties and just ravaged and destroyed. I think that is why. Which would make a lot of sense. I guess they did make an excuse to make a boring town. Though to be fair, a lot of towns in this one are kind of generic. So, they really put all their effort into the boss fights, is what they did. Good girl. How are you doing? Welcome in, Ultima Cluster. How's your day going so far? What a sight. What a sight. And just when they're done with the tornado. Hit them with that. Pew pew. They shot Torval. Come on. 
little brutal. A little brutal. This is even more brutal. Right in the face. All right, then. Joshua, this one's bigger than the others. Yeah, <laughs> that's what she said. Enforcement, man, you are most welcome for the shout out. here if you like don't worry I'll be fine mm, okay don't believe you Look, Clive. Hello. By the founder. The place is a fortress. Lame, couldn't go over that. Whatever. No villages. No knights. Not even any bodies. One could almost believe the whole kingdom had turned to Kashik.
Ooh, I'm sorry, Nito. That's a little rigged. It's okay. We all got safe. I'm just so mad at all the legendary Pokemon that, like, just get away. I feel like that is super rigged. I've never seen someone catch a legendary Pokemon on stream. You have once? I was so mad. I saw Entei and it went away. And I was like, no. So upset. Yeah, I saw your. I, I didn't understand what it meant, though, Nato. What did it mean? What did you get? Tell me. Oh, man. That's rough. Right, so we're actually going to go back to the hideout. I know. Oh. But I need more supplies. And that fight with Barnabas just absolutely drained me. Again, only once? Yeah. No. This game is rigged. You know what's crazy is if you just watch enough streams, you get enough money to buy stuff. So I was like, yeah, screw it. I'm going to buy 100 Ultra Balls. And so I did. <laughs> That's pretty neat. Go on, then. No pun intended. It said you had something new. What do you have that's new? Love these things. I don't want these things. Watch mine. Da -da -da. Hang on, chat. I will be right back. Just have to do a quick bathroom break, and I will be right back. Give me one sec. Well, Nito, I gotta say, even if it's not useful, 22 million gold makes it pretty darn useful. I don't know how in RuneScape... Is it like a barter system, I'm guessing, where you can trade with other people and list what the prices are, and it's just kind of what market value is virtually? I'd say that's pretty That's pretty useful. You're robbing me blind, you know. I know, Karen, I am robbing you blind. You'll not find a better price than that. It'd better all be here. Find Rest in peace, Last that. Elixir. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. What do you want? Have a duck. That just seems silly. Does the Everdark turn into something better? So you need the ice brand. Oh, maybe it does. See, so I need dark steel and primitive battle. I can make it just for having it. It lost you a good while.
Not my best work, but it'll do. Holy crap, 1.4 billion? I can't even imagine that. I've never played RuneScape though. I'm afraid to I can't I can't start anything else until I finish. I gotta beat some games before I can do it. Jeez, third age pickaxe. Oh yes, the <laughs> the third age pickaxe, of course. Like I know what that means. <laughs> Well, let's see what we actually let's go over here. Let's see. Yep. New stuff at the hump board. Let's see what we got on the hunt. Covered in nicks and lumps. Mm, that's pretty cool, though, that they have that. Are there really no side quests in the world right now? It's unbelievable. Wow, that's amazing. Look at that. We'll just confirm with this guy. Clive. Quick look. Oh. Think you can help? Alright, let's see what we got for hunts. Got a lot more. Okay. Pandemonium. Tier S. Question mark where it's located. All right. Gobermooch. The Bygol. The Blood Moon. I'm sure to the Underworld. Go knock out a goblin. A rogue goblin in the abandoned village of East Isla. Wow. I feel like RuneScape is one of those games that you could just get lost in. Absolutely lost in. It's going to be that one. Malud, yeah. See, that's why I fully haven't made the jump into FF14. I'm so afraid it's just going to consume my soul. So I would take it that this is the abandoned village. So we're looking for a gablet. I don't know of another abandoned village. No worries. Thank you so much, Tiny Princess. You have a great rest of your day. Oh, I think I actually missed you earlier. I'm so sorry. Let me give you a shout out before you go. But anyways, thank you so much for coming in. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Where is the goblin? Unless there's another abandoned village. Let's just put it in this main square. That'd make a ton of sense. Could be up. Oh, there's that racing game. That looks so cool.
I see no point in this game that they make you kind of figure out where the hunts are. To me, it adds nothing of value to have to freaking decipher where everything is. I get the ones where it's like you don't know where they are and you stumble across them because that's cool. But in regards to these ones, I'm just like, really? I don't see the point. So if he is not up here, we are just going to go. That's ridiculous. We're going to Google it. One second shot. I don't want to spend a lot of time looking for that. Hunt locations. Do do do. Do do do. It was like a goblin thingy. The gauber. Or the gober mooch. Mooch mouch. Gober mouch. Something along that. I know, Clive. I'm sorry. You gotta wait for me. Well, on a one to silly, that's silly. That's right. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was so close. I think he'd be making some noise, but instead, nope, he's just patiently waiting for me. Yeah. So small. I don't know how he's going to be a rank A. Okay, it does pack a punch, I guess.
I should have Clive. It is a canned animation. He is invisible as far as I know, but if the animation ends and an attack was incoming, he's gonna get hit with it automatically. Like, there's no way for him to dodge it that I'm aware of. Let's see. If we're, he's about to attack and I do this, yeah, there's just, it also slows down time. You're finished. Yeah. So, for the most part, he's invincible if you do that. So it's kind of, I think the Giga Flare is a little overpowered, but it's great for getting the job done. Well, your journey ends here. Better already. Let's see, 9-11, I think we got time for one more hunt. I'm just trying to remember what was on the hunt board that we could do. What did we have? I think we had the Bygall. I think. should just be up here. Yeah, it should be that one right there. And that'll be perfect. There we go. 
Jeez, three in a row. Come on, Clive. Let's hope it was the last of its kind. Let's see if we can do a couple more hunts before I have to come off. The hunts don't take a lot of time, except, geez, the dragon one took forever. I was also severely underpowered when I did that one. Well, then. I'll find a better price than that. You're rubbing me blind, you know. What else do I need to upgrade my weapon more? What do you want? Too dark steel now. Okay, well, I don't know where to get those. That is all right. Um, ba -dum, ba -dum. Covered in nicks and lumps, the lot of them. I want to go down there. Unfortunately, travelers, we are going to have to save that hump for next time. I do indeed need to get ready for work. So thank you so much for joining me on my adventure today. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you for being here. Y'all mean a lot to me. So let's go ahead and see if we can find someone to raid out to. Um, let's go ahead and let's raid out to ooh, Red Dead Redemption 2. We're going to go ahead and we're going to raid out to Synthi TV, who is doing some Red Dead Redemption 2. Thank you so much, Sahara. I can't wait to catch you now that you got everything back up and going. I wish I could do this hunt, but I really do have to get ready for work as much as I wish I could just play games all day. I cannot, unfortunately. But also, in addition to uh, Synthi TV, which we'll read out to go, show some love to RP James 3. He's doing the new Mortal Kombat, and I will be on with him tomorrow morning for some Baldur's Gate 3, our little co op campaign. So let's see if I remember how to do this right now. Jeez. <laughs> it will be tomorrow. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, I just messed up. Hang on real quick. How did I do the freaking raid again? Yeah, I don't know why I'm blinking so hard. So just give me one second and we'll do it the old fashioned way. Raid without the space and the name. Is it just raid? 
I know, like, the auto queue's not coming up for me. It's really weird. We'll do it the old-fashioned way. I don't know why it's being weird today. Oh, you need the... That's what it is. Thank you. Appreciate it. I was like, why am I blanking on it? <laughs> oh, man. It's a morning. Anyways, go check them out. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Uh, <laughs> give a shout out to you too, but I'm ending the stream. So thank you so much to hear.